Hello and welcome to the tutorial on Roman numerals. In this tutorial we are going to introduce Roman numerals and work up to uh, work up to number 10. Now where might you find Roman numerals? Well quite often you see them on clocks. You've got a big clock face over here. You sometimes have the have a pointing here and the shorter hand pointing over here and inside you've got the numbers sometimes now have you seen this in any of the clocks have a look around you may have some of these at uh, at home there we go so sometimes you see, instead of seeing numbers, you see Roman numerals on the clock face. What you also sometimes see is in books or in films. For example, the Star Wars, which is a, a very famous film, you'll sometimes see episode. First one is like this. It's just one there. They actually make it a bit fancy and put two lines at the top and the bottom. You don't have to. Oops, I forgot the E. You don't have to do that. And the next one is episode. Instead of writing down two, they write down in Roman numerals one, two. There's two lines. So you see them in books, you see them on films, um, and you also see them in years. Sometimes it can get very complicated because you end up seeing a lot of letters and you're wondering what they mean. We're going to come on to those a bit later. Let's work with the Roman numerals up to 10. Now the first thing we're going to do is we're going to write down the Roman numerals in the usual way, the method. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. So we've got numbers 1 to 10. Now, what do the Roman numerals look like? Well, we have one, sometimes when you see just a one straight line, that means one. So that is equal to one. Sometimes what you will see, that is equal to one. We'll just write that down. What you also see is a V. Now, what does a V mean? A V means five. V means 5. And what you also see with numbers up to 10 is an X. And the X means 10. Now these three letters, a capital I, a capital V, and a capital X, you can use these three to do all the numbers from 1 to 10. And here is another important point. All the Roman numerals are always in capital letters. They're never small case, they're always capital letters. So let's have a look at this. If we were to write down number 1, it is 1. Number 2 is, we do one line and another line. That means it's 2. So you've got 1 and then 2. How do we do 3? Well, 3 is 3 lines. 1, 2, 3. That's nice and easy, isn't it? Now, 4 is not as simple as you think. It's not four lines. So if we were to do just one, two, three, four, that is incorrect. That is not right. The way we write it down is we write down one first and then write down the V. I'm going to write it down here. I, V. Sorry, I meant to say I, not one. That means four. It's effectively saying if you got one, and the V over here, it's effectively saying 1 before 5. So we're saying IV means 1 before 5. And that is 4. So 1 before 5 is 4. So that is how we write down number 4 in Roman numerals. It is capital I, capital V. The number 5, we've already said, is V. So it's just capital V. So those are all the numbers from 1 to 5. We've got capital I, and I'm just going to 
change color so this we've got capital i one equals one one equals capital i two equals two lines three equals three lines now four is capital i and then capital v i v five is simply just a v so let's carry on so we've done five what about six six is that's right it is v and then i five plus one so you write down v i that means five plus one and that is six what about seven seven is v i i five six seven how about number eight well that is the same v i i i that means five six seven eight now how about the next one excuse me how about the next one we've got nine now nine works on the same principle as we did the four so instead of writing down v one two three four that is not correct you never have four lines together in roman numerals what you have to do here is nine equals i x what does that mean that means it is one before ten now one before ten is nine so the number nine becomes i x it's capital i capital x and number ten we've already said is simply just the x so we've done numbers one to five carrying on six is v i seven is v i i number eight is v and you've got three i's number nine is i x and ten is simply x now what i want you to do is to write the roman numerals from one to ten in order without looking at the, without looking at the screen write them down from one to ten and see if you can get the hang of this and make sure you get number four and number nine correct